Mike Moulton, a uh, cardiothoracic surgeon. Uh, I was trained, uh, I went to medical school uh, at Harvard in Boston. Uh, I was trained at WashU in St. Louis, uh, both for general surgery and cardiothoracic surgery. Uh, I've been in practice for uh, over 20 years now. I think I was influenced at a young age by my grandfather, who was a family practitioner uh, in a small town in Wisconsin. I remember him doing uh, lots of uh, interesting things like pulling fish hooks out of kids' heads and things. I think that really uh, got me uh, excited about medicine and uh, I really uh, never thought of any other career. When I was in fifth grade, I wrote a, a report on uh, cardiothoracic surgery. I seemed to be fascinated by the heart and the physiology of the heart. Uh, and again, something that I've uh, always wanted to do. We treat uh, patients that have coronary artery disease, so uh, we certainly perform coronary bypass, and that's true for, uh, for all of the surgeons here. Uh, I have a particular interest and expertise in, in managing patients with valvular heart disease, so uh, patients that have uh, mitral valve disease uh, uh, specialize in repairing uh, mitral valves. Uh, we, as a group, uh, have an interest in managing patients with uh, aortic disease, and we, uh, I think, do a good job of doing complex aortic surgery. Of course, uh, our entire division uh, specializes in mechanical circulatory support and heart transplantation, and we have one of the bigger programs uh, in the country. The longer I've been in the field, the more I enjoy that part of the, uh, of the job is to, is to meet uh, patients and talk to them and their families um, and to hear you know, what's been going on for them. Uh, I think for me, uh, the most important thing is to listen to the patient. And I, I've learned, uh, again, over the course of the years to carefully listen to the patient and let them tell me what's going on. And then uh, the next part of the uh, conversation is for me to sort of explain to them what I see in the in, uh, uh, in their particular circumstances, what I think is wrong with them, and then how we plan on fixing that. There's no question, as I said, I've been practicing over 20 years. This is the best place I've ever worked at. Uh, there's an incredible number of smart, talented people, uh, and it's, it's not a cliche to say that every single day I learn something new. Uh, we do uh, the cutting edge of the cutting edge, so there's really nothing in cardiothoracic surgery that we don't do and we interact with incredibly smart people, whether it's from anesthesia to critical care to cardiology, uh, and there are people that we lean on heavily to uh, provide their world-class expertise so we can do the best we can with taking care of our patients.